last time Creighton played Georgia about three and a half weeks ago, the Jays went one of 18 from beyond the arc. Today, a different story, though. Creighton hits nine triples and never trailed against the Hoyas. 20th ranked Jays in Georgetown. It's the return of Akoya Gao, the former Omaha Central star. Louisville transfer played inspired basketball. He scored nine points and grabbed nine rebounds for the Hoyas off the bench. Now, we normally think of Cole Huff as an outside shooter, but he can run the floor. He can take it to the rack. Two of his 10 points, all 10 points for Huff in the first half. Marcus Foster with 15 before the break, including this three-pointer. And the Jays shot 55% from the field in the first half. They led by eight at the break. Justin Patton, early foul trouble. We finished strong, 10 points, six rebounds for the fabulous freshman, including back-to-back -back slams. At one point in the second half, part of a 12-2 run really put the game away. The story, though, Marcus Foster scoring a season-high 35 points to go with five boards and five assists. Roll Jays. Creighton wins big, 87-70 the final. Oh, uh, yeah, we really need this game to especially stay where we want to be at in the Big East. And, you know, I think we were really motivated because of how they beat us. And, you know, we don't we, we felt it was disrespect on what they were doing to us at their house. So it was just a little payback we wanted to get today. I mean, we, we just cracked down on a lot of things that we knew that we could take care of. And um, and then we really just hooked up on defense. They missed some some open shots, but I think we forced them into some bad ones. And, you know, we, we took it the other way. Jays now 22 and 5 overall, 9 and 5 in the Big East. Next up, Providence Wednesday night at the CenturyLink Center.